A different take on the standard champion chassis. Hello friends, I'm TTB. Welcome back to German Engineering today with the Champion 2N in a ER Large and AC2 configuration. A long range Dakar, long range lasers that can also go toe to toe and really bring the cockpit shakes to the enemy team. Let's go ahead and have a look at the loadout screen, shall we? Now, in order to fit all of this, we're gonna be very brave. We are going to use an XL275 engine we're pumping in two ear large lasers in the left torso, and we've got three AC2s in the right torso, plus a total of six and a half tons of ammo. How do we get all this ammo in, you might ask? Well, because we're shaving the arms completely, we're shaving the legs a little bit, and we're shaving the cockpit a little bit. So as you can see, this is not a build for the faint of heart. This is dangerous, and that is why, ideally, you want to be second or preferably third line shooting at targets from extreme range and just trying to uh, hamper the ability of the enemy team to shoot back at your teammates. Now, you could also think about putting that ER large laser into the CT slot, but I kind of like the height of those two up here, uh, slightly higher than if you put it into the CT, so that's why we have it in there. Quirk wise, if we scroll down real quick, 10% ballistics cooldown, 10% ballistics range, 5% energy heat, all not bad to have. And then, of course, uh, we have our skills in the skill tree, which we will cover presently. Alpha Strike Firepower is 24, which is not much, but keep in mind, guys, these uh, AC2s are going to churn out a total of 6 damage every 0.64 seconds. So this adds up over time, and on top of that, you have the ER large lasers just pumping out their glorious damage. And the cool thing about this mech is uh, you have hit scan on the one side, but also duck on the other side. So you have a mix of projectiles and hit scan, uh, which can be a problem in some cases if small targets moving left to right, but it can also be a boon in other cases where you're trying to hit a target that's moving very fast. You can hit it easily with the lasers. You can't hit it as much with the AC2s. So it is a mixed bag, experimental, as I said, but... Uh, Without further ado, let's go ahead and check out the skill tree. By the way, 74.3 kph of speed. For the skill tree, uh, we're going a little bit experimental as well. Three points in cooldown. We've got range and heat gen, of course. We've got velocity, magazine capacity for our AC2s. We've got the laser duration for our ER large lasers. Full armor, full structure, of course. And then over here, this is where we get into a point where some things are optional, some things are must-have. Must-have, double Kusha with Kusha cooldown, advanced zoom. And then... I would say cooldown and heat containment are also must have. And that you, you, you can actually make a choice. You can go improve gyros. If you do that, then you can go either seismic or you can go a little bit deeper into uh, range deprivation. I will leave it up to you. I like having seismic on long range max because it makes it harder for enemy max to sneak up on you, especially like lights, like a look, so whatever. With this, you even at least have a chance of noticing them come in. If you don't take improved gyros against the cockpit check that you will take from enemy max shooting Daka at you, you could also go ahead and remove those uh, points then in cooldown. That gives you seven points and that would allow you to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three points. The classic in radar deprivation. I will leave it up to you. Now you guys will be asking, well, TDB, that's all nice and dandy. We're looking forward to that. But what's going to be your next mech? And I will say the next mech is lit not going to limp into battle but is going to proverbially into battle. Let's see. I mean, this was, a, this was, one was on the nose, right? Let's see who gets it. Also, the mech is very lucky. <laughs> okay, that's, that's an easy one, isn't it? Guys, if you enjoy this content, if you want to support me, check out the join button right here on YouTube. You can send a super thanks through the comment system in YouTube, or you can, of course, check out the various options in the video description below. As always, thank you to everybody who is supporting. Enjoy the clips and have a very pleasant day. I mean, a map like this, for example, is actually always nice. Like Mining Collective, you can always play because it has a lot of line of sight blockers. Even though it is a smaller map and you have some dedicated uh, sniper uh, POVs, it's always going to allow you to at least have a good match, even if you're a brawler. But other maps might not afford you the same luxury, like I don't know, Alpine Peaks, for example. It's a clusterfuck. It's just a giant long range map. I think they're going to try to get around the problem of redesigning all the maps by um, allowing you like a drop deck where you can select from mechs. We'll see how that one goes. Artillery strike online. 
I had a lot of fun in 8v8 queue, and I had a lot of fun in event queue when there were no groups. And I was actually, I was also getting matched against like really good players, but it was an even playing field. As soon as you add groups to the mix, it just becomes skewed. Big time. Alright, let's see what we can do from here. Looks like a good spot. Target spotted. Target spotted. Oh, there's an arm actually. Haha. <laughs> Careful that we don't go out of bounds here. Target spotted. Yep, that's out of bounds. How far? That's okay. That's when I don't have out of bounds anymore. Nice. That's an evil spot, isn't it? I like this spot. It's just a less effective right now because the enemy team isn't really pushing it with big boys, but if that happens, it's really nice. New target acquired. There we go, that's a big boy that we can shoot. Enemy base is being captured. Heat level critical. Poke again, guy. Come on, do it. Thank you. Heat level critical. Heat level critical. Toasty. Oh, now I'm getting artillery struck. Uh oh. Here comes the skill. Where's the skill lord? Come on, skill boy, where are you? So this guy. Well, one kill behind right now, but we do own the top right now, and he's a little bit confused. Heat level critical. Just hard to hit with the AC twos because the projectors are relatively slow compared to the other stuff. That also be easier to hit right now. New target acquired. Oh, we'll take the time to cool down. It took a lot of damage here, by the way. And right now I'm on an easy kill. But I was successful in actually clearing up the top here for our team. I'm just gonna keep holding this position. New target acquired. Might pull ahead here. Need oh, is the Viper still not dead? Wow. Um, yeah, nobody can help you over there, so I'm sorry. That one grasshopper up top, rest seems clear. Target spotted. Anybody see where that king crab went? New Never target mind, it's over acquired. there. Alright, I'm gonna relocate here. Out of bounds, no? That's a good UV. Out of bounds. What the hell are they all? This is weird. Okay, he's gonna need some backup here. Target acquired. Out of bounds. See? The inbounds, we need to kill this UV fast. Come on. Okay. Target spotted. That's not New good. Target acquired. Target spotted. He's gonna keep poking at me from this corner. So we fall back a little bit. New target, target spotted. Acquired. There's a Niger. Target nope. destroyed. Target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. New target spotted. That's my grasshopper friend, okay. Target 
Target spotted. Oh, let's kill him. Target oh, destroyed. Yeah, they got him. All right. All right. Well. Target acquired. What do we have here? Actually, we might still lose this. We might still lose this. Come on, stop jumping around, Mick. Stop jumping around. Shadow Cat and Fox 4. Target spotted. Target acquired. They split up. They split up. Alright. Dude, how fast are you with one side trusser? Oh, he's got missiles. Rip. So Nova Cat's still alive in the end. GG. Oh, yeah, yeah. And Nova Cat was still alive, fresh. That is sad. 773 for all the shooting we did. One killing blow, one KMDD. And three components, plus a UV. That's kind of sad. Alright, well. Where do we stick? Let's see. There's a Kodiak Spirit Bear. Oh, it's an even bigger burrito. Yes, yes, we'll, we'll stick with that guy. He's a burrito. I'll, I'll stick with him. Is that a blood asp and a night star? Okay, we got some thick boys here. We can stick with them. Oh, okay, could you found something in Delta 5? Needs Hulk. Needs, did I say Hulk or Hulk? Still fresh though. Nothing happened. Nothing bad. Oh, hello. Oh, and up top here. Target spotted. Where are you going, good sir? Target spotted. Target acquired. Let's drop down. Target acquired. Now we go here. Oh, I can't help him. New target acquired. No. Yes. Sometimes you just gotta keep shooting. Ah, damn it. That would have been the kill shot. Alright. Not bad though. Now we just need to kill that blood ass somehow. Ow. Need assistance. Target spotted. Delta 4 blood ass CT one shot. Let's call it out. Somebody can kill him, hopefully. Uh, the second I leave, he comes up behind the cover. Damn it! Unlucky. Let's go help the blood ass here. Mm, should I go wide here, I wonder? I think I go wide. Might not be the best move, but we'll see what it is in a sec here. New target acquired. Target spotted. Oh, he's coming back. I knew he would be coming back. That's why I went behind cover. New target 
required. Now what? Got a codec next to me, so we can push this. Which is a good thing. As a UV above. And I have no arms! Kodik is going up against three or four dudes over that, that corner. That's not good. We're super split right now. Acquired. I need to help the Kodik somehow. But I can't help him from this angle. And I don't know if that's gonna help either, but we'll try it. One kill behind right now. Looks like they are surrounding us, but we're surrounding them at the same time. It's... It's a gangbang. It's an all-sided gangbang. I need to get the fuck out of here. Actually, no, I have teammates over there. So... Going this way should work, actually. Of the enemies are eliminated. Might come up against the panther. Acquired. Need assistance! Affirmative! Mm-hmm. Where's the mad cat, though? Oh, here he is. And, of course, he dies right as we come around the corner. Perfect timing. <laughs> the classics are the best ones. Okay, let's not push through the center here. Oh yeah, yeah. What? Why is he? Now destroyed. he's dead. Okay. All right. All right. He's dead, Jim. Now what? Who shot? Who shot? Yeah, this guy shot. Target spotted. My target is a Marauder too. Gauss PPC. Huh. New target acquired. Okay, let's move. Get into another good position where we can fight from. That means just falling back a little bit. Using a range. And then shooting like this, hopefully, if I can get to a proper angle. Nope. That's not a good angle. There's not there's really no good angle right now for me, unfortunately. Huh. The locust necro form. Target acquired. As long as I'm not shooting, I'm not helping, which sucks. So. New target acquired. To find a different spot. This could work. The enemies are half depleted. Keep pushing. Or not. New target acquired. We've lost half our force. We can't lose any more soldiers. New target acquired. What's he doing up there? Hmm. Whatever he's doing is very annoying while he's doing it. Oh god, he's now here. Target Legs of the house How's that locust going? Locust one shots the team. Oh shit, it's just gonna sit up there and rain down missiles on us. All right. We're taking critical losses. Not we looking good. Not looking good. New target acquired. Right arm critical damage. It's fresh. Right arm destroyed. It is one hundred percent fresh. Are you back now? Okay, Control didn't die. Can anyone read? I hit him so many times, he just didn't die with his open CT. Uber Styler, thanks for the tier 1. Much appreciated. Whoop. 
Not a bad round for me though. Two KMDDs, 800 damage. Unfortunately, we literally caved like that flank from that learn board was really nice. That's basically what won in the match. Up, we did end up doing top damage in the match by one damage. <laughs> For that kind of build, it's actually not bad. GG.